Time for another smart summon video, this time with an updated version of version 10, uh, 36.2.1 this time. And we're going to be using a different parking lot. This one has some larger barriers, stop signs, and lines. We plan to use a couple of different parking lots in different scenarios, but it started to rain, so we'll start with two. For this first test, we'll be going from an upper section of the parking lot to the lower section, um, where there's a large barrier um, and some bump outs as well as a uh, stop sign. You can see here where as you move the target, it starts updating its path. And then once you select go to target, it snaps to the center of the screen and then the summon begins. So you'll see it pause here at the stop sign. I think it pauses for all intersections. Uh, in fact, it was saying pausing for intersection. You see it turns the uh, turn signal on uh, at the intersection, which is nice. And then um, you can see in the top right, it's updating its path as it's moving along. And though it seems like it's much closer to the outside of the parking lot, it's driving pretty much down the middle of that area, maybe a little bit closer uh, to the right side. It pauses again for that intersection. Uh, there is no stop sign on that side. And uh, then comes up to where we have it set. It does seem to be a lot more confident now with this latest version. Uh, it stops less, the steering is more steady. But we'll have to confirm that with some more tests. For the second test, we're still going from the upper portion of the parking lot to the lower portion. But um, a little bit further away, we wanted to see how far it would travel down one lane. This was about as far as we could get it to go without it deciding to go the other direction through the parking lot. Just like the first test, it's very confident pulling out of the spot. And um, after it starts moving forward, it goes right up to its maximum speed of four or five miles an hour. It goes nice and straight through this section of the parking lot. Uh, it's a little bit to the right side, uh, but still a little centered in the lane. Um, comes up to the end of the aisle here, pauses for the intersection, um, starts to go, then turns its turn signal on. Digs corner a little bit wide, but I'm sure that if there were cars on the other side there, it would uh, take the corner sharper. One thing I noticed is that after it came uh, back towards us, the windshield wipers actually turned on and I had the windshield wipers turned off and the auto wiper beta turned off. So it can override that uh, when it needs to for summon, which is pretty neat. So this was a good test and next time we're going to find another parking lot with some cars. Thanks for watching.